Happening now, the search is now on for at least three people lost in the water across our state, including one person here in Indianapolis. The National Weather Service says the rain we've gotten recently is producing fast and strong currents. And as Mary Mills shows us tonight, those conditions are continuing in this search in the White River. DNR officers were back on the White River using sonar to search for the body of 52-year-old Terrence Williams. Williams and his fiance had been canoeing Saturday afternoon when they returned to the Lake Indy boat ramp near 28th Street just before 6. She had went up to their vehicle thinking they were going to leave, um, and for some unknown reason, he went back out on the canoe. Soon after, he was spotted downstream in the river. Quillen says this is where two people saw Williams floating alongside his canoe just a quarter mile from the launch site. A few moments later, they say he disappeared. Williams' canoe with his life jacket was found just south of the 16th Street Lowhead Dam. Quillen says it may not look it, but the river is running high and fast. And we urge everybody to wear their life jackets, especially on rivers and canoes and kayaks, and because everything's so unpredictable. Um, you've got to always keep in mind that the danger is there, that something can happen, and uh, wearing your life jacket is one way to avoid that. Quillen says the fast-moving murky water also makes the search more difficult. He says they have to be fairly confident they've located a body before sending divers in for recovery. He says today's search will continue until nightfall. Mary Mills, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. And there is a new search underway for a missing kayaker in the northwest part of our state. Conservation officers are telling us the kayaker went underwater around 8 o'clock this morning in Tippecanoe River. This is in White County. The Monticello Fire Department is now helping with that search.